everyone, I'm Michelle, your English teacher. Welcome to yet another exciting class. Today, our learning targets are I can read and write one syllable words with the R spelling. I can ask and answer questions about key details in the story Things That Swim. Interesting topics. So, today, we will be learning a new sound R. 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 And R is spelled A R. A R. A R. 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 R as in car. R as in car. So, to be able to pronounce the R sound, you could just say car. R. You could just say a word that has the R sound to help you pronounce the vowel sound R. R. The following word have the R sound at the beginning. Repeat after me. Ak. Um. Arch. Art. Ak. Um. Arch. Art. An ak is spelled A R K. Ak. A R K. Ak. Um is spelled A R M. Um. A R M. Ah. Arch is spelled A R C H. Arch. A R C H. Arch. Art is spelled A R T. Art. A R T. Art. Remember, the following words have the R sound in the beginning. The following words have the R sound in the middle. Repeat after me. Farm. Farm. Hard. Hard. Cut. Cut. Mark. Mark. Lock. Lock. Farm is spelled F A R M. Farm. F A R M. M farm you can hear the R sound the R sound is present in farm hard hard is spelled H A R D hard H A R D hard, hard. cut is spelled C A R T cut C A R T cut Mark is spelled M A R K Mark M A R K Mark Lock is spelled L A R K Lock L A R K Lock the following words have the R sound at the end. Repeat after me. Car. Car. Jar. Jar. Far. Far. Star. Star. Tar. Tar. Car is spelled C-A-R. Car. Car is spelled C A R. Car. Jar is spelled J A R. Jar. Jar is spelled J A R. Jar. Far is spelled F A R. Far. Far is spelled F A R. Far. Star is spelled S T A R star. Star is spelled S T A R star. Tar is spelled T A R star. 
Ta is spelled T A R. Ta. I am going to say some words. Some have the R sound and some do not. Close your eyes and listen to the sounds. Park. Cut. Match. Kid. Bat. Now these words have different sounds, but most of them have the R uh sound, like park, cut, match. Park, cut, match. Match is spelled M A R C H. Match. Match is spelled M A R C H. Match. Kid is spelled K I D. K I D. It doesn't have the K uh, sound. It doesn't have the A uh, sound. Bat is spelled B A T. Bat. B A T. Bat. Shark. Book. Chart. Farm. Herd. Yard. Hush. Shark. Book. Chart. Fern. Head. Yarn. Hush. Shark is spelled S H A R K. It has the R sound. S H A R K. Book is spelled B O O K. Book. It has the short O sound. It has the short O sound. Book is spelled B O O K. Book. Chart is spelled C H A R T. Charts. C H A R T. Charts. And it has the R sound. Fern is spelled F E R N Fern and Fern has the R er sound. It has the R er sound. Head is spelled H E R D Head H E R D Head and Head has the R er sound. It has the R er sound. Yard is spelled Y A R D yard Y A R D yard and yard is spelled Y A R D yard pronounce it yard yard and it has what sound the R sound it has the R sound and we have the word Hash, hash, and hash is spelled H A R S H. H-A-R-S-H. H-A-R-S-H. And it has the R sound. The R sound. Now, these are words that has the R and the R sounds. The R and the H. The R and the R uh sound. R uh is spelled E R. Why R is spelled A R. Now the words that have the R uh sound is her, verb, term, her, verb, term. Why the words that have the R uh sound is Cur, 
burn sharp car burn sharp let's trace the r spelling on your decks we will trace this r this r spellings in blue because the r sound has both a consonant and vowel sound it has what a consonant and vowel sound can someone tell me the consonant sound and the r sound r is the consonant sound r is the consonant sound remember we have how many vowel sounds five a e i o u five vowel sounds so a is automatically a vowel sound a is a vowel sound open your worksheet 4.1 you would see the r sound boldly written on page 13 of your work sheet 4.1 what i want you to do is that you're going to write copy the diagraphs and words you should say the words and say the sounds while writing to get acquainted to know how to pronounce this sound so i wanted to open your fable readers so that we could read the things that swim open your table of content and find the story things that swim what type of things might you expect to see in today's story the stories in these readers are fictions because the stories are made up however the information in these stories is true we call this type of story informational text informational thirks so i read things that swim i hope you kids like things that swim because this is the room where we keep all the fish the fish here are trout a trout is a fish that swims in cool lakes and creeks you can see that they have lots of spots and marks the spots and marks help the trout hide they make the trout look a lot like the sand on the bed of a creek here is a big fish that makes all of the wee fish run and hide this is a reef a reef shark it has that name because it likes to make its home close to a reef where there are lots of fish where there are lots of fish you can see that the reef shark has fins and a set of gills on its side you cannot see them from here but this shark has lots of sharp teeth in its mouth would a reef shark bite you well you are not the lunch that the shark would like best a reef shark likes to feed on squids crabs and shrimps but would be smart not to get the reef shark mad at you or the same did you enjoy the story because i did remember they are fictional but informative text let's review our spellings we have the r sound we have the owl sound and we have the tricky words remember we always treat tricky words tricky words are words that don't follow the words the rules they don't follow the rules so r under the r sound we have mark shark and smart remember the shark is smart remember we read 
all of this inside our readers so mark is pronounced remember we said that the trout fish has marks on its body we talked about the shark and we said that the shark is smart now mark is spelled m a r k mark m a r k mark shark is spelled s h a r k shark s h a r k shark smart is spelled s m a r t smart s m a r t smart we have the owl sound the owl sound and under the owl sound we have mouth 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 remember th is pronounced th 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 mouth trough 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 and mouth is spelled m o u t h mouth m o u t h mouth trout is spelled t r o u t trout t r o u t trout our tricky words are because and here because and here remember tricky words don't follow the rules so because is spelled b e C A U S E because because so because 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 here is spelled H E R E here H E R E here let's review the vocabularies we have creeks creeks we have bed of a creek bed of a creek we have we we have we so creek is spelled c r e e k s c r e e k s bed of creek bed of a creek bed of a creek creek is spelled c r e e k why bird is spelled b e d bed is spelled b e d we is spelled w e e we is spelled w e e we riff is spelled r e e f riff is spelled r e e f fins is spelled f i n s fins is spelled f i n s Gills is spelled G I L L S. Gills is spelled G I L L S. Remember, fishes have gills. Fishes have gills. Squid is spelled S Q U I D. Squid is spelled S Q u i d squid let's read to find out the names of the different types of animals that swim in the green fern zoo what is the main topic of today's story what is the main topic of today's story the things that swim things that swim what type of animals are in today's story? 
we have trouts we have shark and we have what other fishes we have shark we have trout we have other fishes now name the fish described in today's story name the fish described in today's story you could name any fish shark was described trout was described so where would you find a trout where would you find a trout trouts are found in creeks and cool lakes trouts are found in cool lakes and creeks why might a trout hide in creek because it has marks it has marks so those marks helps it adapt to creeks it helps it adapt to its environment it hides it from animals like sharks why does the reef shark like to be near reefs where there are lots of fishes because okay you would take this as a home assignment you will go to your houses you're going to write down the answer why does the reef shark like to be near reefs where there are lots of fishes so number seven is how are trout and reef sharks similar and how are they different open your worksheets 4.2 you would see the r and the r sounds so i want you to read the instructions carefully and answer the questions on your worksheets 4.2 page 15. phrases and sentences phrases and sentences farm the land farm the land hack the sound Hack the sound. Pack the car. Pack the car. Sleep in the dark. Sleep in the dark. Look at the shark. Look at the shark. Run in the park. Run in the park. Smile at the clock. Smile at the clock. Hard coin. Hard coin hard coin lots of verbs lots of verbs green pack green pack big dog's back big dog's back big dog's back big dog's back get a card get a card do no harm do no harm do no harm do no harm mark the mile mark the mile mark the mile mark the mile big shark big shark big shark big shark act the pot act the pot act the pot pull a cut pull a cut pull a cut make some art make some art make some art feel an arc feel an arc feel an arc mark the chart mark the chart he head in the yard head in the yard head in the yard thank you for having an amazing time with me i'll meet you in our next video have an amazing day